So it's always hard to know what sort of game to make with these big sprawling enemies and they don't get much bigger or more sprawling than no. One Piece. Mm. And they went the Musa route, which is to basically do crossover games with the basic mechanics of, you know, Dynasty Warriors style games. And this is the third entry, the first that's sort of coming into the, the new gen as well, the PS4. Yeah. Now, the first game was a sort of standard abridged version of the story up to that point, which was up until about the time skip. Mm. The second game went past the time skip, but was more of a dream scenario, so it was just a whole bunch of made up scenarios. And this third game is sort of taking a bit from both, in that it has the abridged story, almost all the way up to where the manga's up to now, Do Flamingo, mm. and it has a dream mode where you just get to play a bunch of random maps and do sort of random stuff as well. But coming into this game, I think you do want to actually be a fan of the series because, hey, it, it, like a lot of the leveling up system, it's explained, but it's very much takes from the previous game, which is two. It takes from the coins and like, it's much easier to jump in this game if you've played one yeah, and two. Exactly. There's so many mechanics and there are so many different leveling up systems that mm. unless you have a, an understanding, it will be confusing. But yeah. if you had if you have played the previous, it makes complete sense because it's pretty much not changed at all. Yeah. And it's like, with all the story modes and all the in jokes and things like that, like the ability to, you know, take your hat off and things like that, it really is a game that is to be enjoyed by the fans. fans. Yeah. And it has a lot of interesting references that otherwise, you know, most people would just see it as a regular Muso game. That said, like, the actual story itself is really, really well done. The scenes that are shown, they're very coming out very well nice on the PS4. Like, yeah, they're, uh, they're working it hard to the bone and it's bringing really nice detail. Yeah, but the one thing about the game is that it is a time scene. And, you know, if you want to be a pirate, you've got to give up your life. Mm -hmm.